So guys, there's a couple things I want to talk to you about. There's some bullshit that happened to me yesterday. So as you know, I'm not sure if you guys seen it or not. Hopefully, whatever problem I'm going through right now is going to be fixed by the time this video is actually out. I I had an issue to where I was actually um, going on a spree, a deletion spree of ghost followers and everything, right? So I was trying to find the best ways to do mass deletion and stuff like that, you know, to get rid of ghost followers because I only want people that fuck with me to follow me. That's it. I don't care about my follower account. I don't care if it go all the way down to 10,000. I don't care if I lose 5,000. I really don't care about that. I want to make sure people who want to see my content are seeing it, not people who just click follow and sit there for years and don't even interact with me once. That's not how this goes. I'm not, I'm not that type of person. I'm not a clout chaser. You know what I'm saying? That's just not me. So what I had done was I downloaded this third party app and I'm saying this to you guys right now because I want to make you guys aware of hopefully what could happen to you if you decide to use this app or go down this path. There are a lot of third party apps that allows you to look at your follower account, look at who's following you, who's being more active, look at who left you. Why did you leave me, bitch? Okay. And um, a whole bunch of stuff, right? So I was a dumbass. I actually, I actually um, thought that this this app was probably legit. It, the app is probably legit. It probably works, but the sign-in system. Instagram has this thing to where if you sign in multiple times on something, it thinks that you're somebody else. And especially if you log in on a certain on another device. Like, see, if I got Instagram on my phone right here. And on the phone I'm recording on right now, if I'm able to sign in on here, it's going to ask me, am I sure this person is is me trying to sign in on this phone? And if I have a desktop computer, if I'm trying to sign in on there, it's going to ask me the same thing. It don't like doing a multiple devices shit for some reason. I, I'm starting to see that now. So what happened to me was I don't personally think it's the third party app that messed me up. I think it's the fact that I signed in that um, I had to re-sign in to the app on my phone that I was using. That's what caused the trigger to make it seem like that I'm doing something illegal or something like that, breaking Instagram standards and shit. So that's what happened to me yesterday. So I got this tag, I think around like seven o'clock yesterday. And then I did some research to figure out when possibly I could get my stuff back. I was shipping shit to Instagram like crazy, but of course we all know Instagram's customer service is basically non-existent. It doesn't exist. There's no such thing as Instagram customer service. There's no person you could talk to. You can just phone up and be like, hey, what's going on, homie? My shit is blocked. You can't really do that. So you have to send in a request to, to this void that you don't even know is getting to somebody. So I just sat back and I just, I'm like, hey, you know what? Whatever, whatever. If it, if it comes back, it comes back. If it don't, it don't. I'm that type of person. I really don't care. I can build my shit back up from, you know, from square one try to get people who was following me before to, um, you know, who really mess with my stuff to come, in, come over here, you know, like to this place. And we just want to build the channel from there. It is what it is, right? I can't cry about it. I can't get pissed. If it comes back, it comes back great. But even if it comes back, I'm still going to use this as a learning lesson to be like, okay, I'm going to keep this account for my main. I'm going to create a second account on Instagram. That's going to be my backup to where I'm going to post whatever I want to, you know what I'm saying? Like, just like a follow up or whatever for my main one. That's gonna be my backup account. I'm gonna create a backup account regardless, but especially if I get it back, I'm gonna let every single one of my followers know, follow that account. So that's just my little rant for what's been going on in my life for right now. Hopefully by the time this video goes up, I won't have to worry about that. It's probably back, you know, who knows? What's going on guys? It's the end of the video. I wanted to cut this shit short. I was gonna do two videos in one. I'm not doing that this time because that video would have been probably like 30 minutes long. So this is an update plus a cut in, slide in, you know, to your DMs, end of the video type shit right now, because update, I got my page back. I got my page back at the time I thought I was gonna get it back today, but still, that don't change shit. This just opened up my eyes a little bit too on what I'm gonna do next. So what I'm gonna do is there's gonna be a little link or a little um, icon or whatever right here that's gonna let you know exactly where to go for my second channel. This is gonna be my backup channel. It's gonna be the one that just in case some fucked up shit happened with my first channel, I'm gonna be posting on this one instead. Just to let you guys know, I figured out what the real problem was. The real problem was I was unfollowing 400 people. That's the reason why. That's the reason why I flagged me. What the fuck? What the fuck? So yeah.
stupid bitch.